Hello, I'm Gary Simon, and I was delighted when Sheila Conway asked me to do a little blog for the WPS Eco, part of the US Eco Shawl Initiative. What we're trying to do is encourage people of all ages and experiences to get involved in uh, gardening when there's so much concrete and artificial lawns. Uh, gardening is wonderful for our well-being, wonderful for the environment and in particular for pollinators. Today I'm going to talk about my passion for container gardening and here you can see I have around 50 containers in the, in the garden. So on the left I have my shade loving plants because this is the area of the garden that gets the afternoon shade. So I have my coleus plants and my hoochers. Notice how I've grouped the colours. The beauty of container gardening is that you can arrange your colours uh, to suit you. So here I've got um, my golds and red colours specifically and note how I repeat the pattern through the display to provide interest. On the right hand side is my sunny side of the garden for most of the day and here I'm planting my um, uh, pachoas, my petunias, my geraniums and also some carefully chosen small varieties of dahlia that will work well on the uh, patio and of course my favourites the cannas that love the sun both small ones and large ones at the back. Down this side of the garden is bee alley uh, this is where I've got my lavenders and very successfully grew cosmos this year, this yellow plant that attracts the, the bees all the time. And it's wonderful to see uh, bees actually uh, hopping from one plant to the other all day long. As for watering, it's quite easy. I use one of these arms to get into the plants. So the other big advantage of container gardening is that you can substitute plants at any time or move them. If they aren't working in one place, they might work better in another place. Here, for example, I've got a dwarf sunflower that I've grown from seed, and I'm going to use it to substitute some of the pansies that are going over at this point of the year. So I hope you really enjoyed this introduction to container gardening. I hope it encourages you to try it for yourself. If you need any help or advice or you want to come and visit me, please so you know where to get hold of me or contact Sheila Conway. I hope you enjoy gardening for the rest of the summer and I look forward to talking to you again about another topic later in the year.